On Account of the Gum, written and illustrated by Adam Rex. What? What? Oh, are you serious right now? That's the gum right there that you got in your hair. On account of the gum that you got in your hair, your dad said, sit still, and your sister said, duck, and you sat very still. So the scissors got stuck in the gum that you got in your hair. Okay, we went on some websites and all of them promise if you want to get scissors and gum out of your hair, you take two sticks of butter and you smear them along and... Oh man, this is bad. I see. It appears that those websites were wrong. Uh -huh. Don't you give me that look, young lady. Your aunt, Heisha, said she knew how to get the gum out. From this tip in a book she was reading about, in the paper or something, she couldn't say where. The point is, that's why you have grass in your hair. I promise it can work, Shun. Your grandpa, hey hon, who said that your aunt was mistaken, is mostly to blame for the noodles and bacon. It's all in this bacony, noodly mass with the scissors, gum, hair, sticks of butter, and grass. Hmm, your rabbit eats grass. <sighs> because of the grass that you got in your hair, I assume that your rabbit could help us in there, but your rabbit just sat like it thinks it's a hat, so I thought it'll leave if I bring in the cat. I'm prepared to admit. I was wrong about that. Oh, I know what to do. It's a little bit mean, but the cat always gets really scared when I clean. Just watch. She'll run off and hide under the bed if the vacuum comes anywhere close to your head. <sighs> Wait, no, um, no. I was thinking of the old cat. Sorry about that. You aren't came back. Sure. And she has a new take. It's cake. She thinks she can fix things with cake. Don't worry. We stopped her and showed her the door. Uh, I doubt she'll be coming around anymore. Though the cake that she made you wound up on the floor. Oopsie. Oh, well, that reminds me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Is this bad timing? Oh. All right, let's get serious. This is the plan. We blow the gum out of, with a powerful fan. Plus, every few seconds, we'll pop a balloon, and the guy with the bees said he'd get them here soon. And, oh, I hear sirens. The firemen came. They complained when we called, but they came just the same with their hoses and one of those dogs and a cop and a big pot of chili. They're ready to... Okay. I mean, I just thought we were going to hear the album. I mean, I know, me too. I just saw that. Oh, what a bitch. Jeez. Rude. Huh. So that's the solution. Well, what do you know? Too bad about all of that rest of it, though. The rest of the stuff that's still stuck in your hair. Now your aunt is all stuck up in there. How'd that happen? I can't take it. Anyway, you better get to school. Why? Because otherwise you're going to miss picture day. <laughs> oh, I can't even. On account of the gum. The end.